Hey YouTube, good morning, it's Chuck. I guess I need to say hi to Twitter, I gotta get used to that. I'm posting these videos both to Twitter subscribers and to YouTube for the uh, viewing pleasure of your preference. So I've got a new scenario I'm gonna try to create here and this is all about the merge. Uh, I've got two waypoints here at Wilson Boulevard and 103rd Street on I-295. You can see it here and they both have merges onto a highway. So I'm going to try to do some repeat scenarios to see if we get any sort of uh, using the blinker and better uh, merge behavior on the highway. Uh, give some data points for people to talk about and also for uh, Tesla engineers to maybe use to improve the behavior. It looks like um, this will start here. It's probably going to be, oh, he went for a red arrow. So it's going to be red arrow for me. Uh, and then we'll join this on-ramp here to the left. I'm not exactly sure the best camera configuration to get the best view uh, of the merge. So I'm going to try my um, 360 camera on the top that's positioned a little bit like I was doing on that narrow roads video. And we'll see what kind of view we can get with the uh, opposing traffic. Because the hardest part about watching a, a merge on video as opposed to driving it is you don't get a real good sense of the rear hind quarter uh, traffic that you've got to deal with, whether you should accelerate or decelerate based on the other cars that are present. Wow, it's acting like it wants to go, but I have got a red light here. I just felt a bump and it's definitely, okay, that, that was interesting. Okay, needs to go. It's a green arrow. All right, I'm disengaging for a green arrow onto the on-ramp and it must have been confused. Refused to go for a green arrow. Okay. We're re-engaged now. Uh, I'm, that may have been obstruction due to that sign or something like that, but it was waiting like it was a, a, a yield. But let's see what we got here, okay? It's wide open to the left. So this is a very quick merge. Let's see if we got it. No blinker, no blinker. It's going all the way to the end and just merging over. So with no traffic, that is completely fine. Um, but that looks like it's the exact same behavior as we had before. So that's round one. Uh, we'll jump off uh, this on-ramp and then we'll come back around to uh, Wilson and we'll see, see what we think. We got the merge going. I'm right behind a motorcycle. Um, here we are again. A very quick merge. A little shorter. There is no traffic again. Still no blinker on this one. Kind of hugs the right line and it just joins. So there's two scenarios. It looks like it's behaving the same way. Hugging the right side to the end of the merge to do a true zipper. Uh, still wishing we had a traffic signal there. Maybe, uh, maybe with a little bit more traffic it'll give a signal. We'll give it another one. Okay, I'm at this traffic signal. It is marked blue and red, but it cannot go. Attempting to run red left arrow. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure why it tried to do that. It's definitely there within my view, and I am lower than this uh, forward-facing camera. Um, but it definitely is trying to go. It's not marked blue. Nothing's marked blue here in this scenario. If I re-engage, now it stopped. But if you notice that sign, now it's green, but it can't see it. So there's a little bit of an implied logic there. That is a tricky sign. If you can't see it, um, the only indication I had that it was uh, my turn to go was that the red went away. Uh, that was interesting. Okay, so here we have another merge. Uh, same one we did a couple uh, rounds ago. Merging to the south. Light traffic day. I need to do this during rush hour. This is gonna be a pretty quick test if we're not gonna get any traffic scenarios. But here we are in the merge. Hugging the right line all the way to the left. Okay, I think that's the behavior we're probably gonna see. I'll do one more just for a, a complete data set. All right, here we go. Probably the last one I'm gonna do today. We do have a car right next to me. 
And look at that. Ooh, slow and so it it kind of created the scenario I've been hoping to create where it wanted to get over. I almost pushed him over without a blinker because we were both racing towards the same data point. Um, so I think that merge behavior has not changed in 11.4.2. Uh, um, and I think we might have gotten the best scenario right there on that last one. So there you go. That's uh, highway merges.